We begin with an update on a fatal motorcycle accident yesterday on the south side of town on Staples at SPID. Three News reporter Marissa Cummings joins us live in the studios with the latest on tonight's top story. While John Thomas, the driver of the motorcycle killed in Sunday's crash, has been identified as 35 year old Earl McMichael. CCPD says, according to eyewitnesses, around 2 30 a.m. on Sunday, McMichael was stopped at a traffic light going northbound on Staples and SPID. Police say when the first set of traffic lights turned to green, he sped off, and when he passed the second set of lights at the underpass, they were still red, resulting in the mo motorcycle crashing into the side of a vehicle. McMichael and the 36 year old woman who was the passenger were thrown off the bike. The set of lights at that intersection are operated by TxDOT in conjunction with the city. The city wants to remind drivers to be patient at lights, especially at busy highway intersections, so traffic can flow safely. And like I said, we want to make sure we try to have the traffic on SPID flow as clearly as possible. So sometimes you'll have to stop at one light, and by the time you get to the next one, it might not be green when you get there, but it'll turn green shortly afterwards. The city says most of the busiest intersections are off of SPID. And coming up at 6, we'll have more on one man who was at the scene of this accident moments after it happened. John Thomas. Thank you, Marissa.